Hello, welcome back to a monster's expedition. Now it says that there's something to do up here, but I certainly don't see anything to do up there. So I'm gonna go back here to the most recent area and see if I can get to some of these other tracks, these other paths that we haven't gone to. See if I can get over there. So what I need to do is make a raft here, it looks like. That would be difficult. I would need to come from over here and push. Oh, I could probably. I might be able to do that. Like, push a log down here and then push this one down. But then I couldn't push it down again. Hmm. Get over here. No, I wouldn't need a raft here. I just need to push a tree right here. What happens when I do this? Oh, easy. No. Okay. So. What I need to do is I need to... Probably... Put one log in here. And then roll the other one. No. Because I couldn't push it that way. I need to get something to be here. Huh. Hmm. I can push it down uselessly. So what if instead, this might be how I started it before, I don't remember. Put it down here and then roll this here and then roll it here. Then what? I can roll it down, but then nothing. Huh. do this. Oh, and then I can get back over here. I don't know if I'm doing anything. Hmm. I can push it this way, but that wouldn't work. That wouldn't do what I need it to. Okay. How about this? No. Okay, what I need to do is I need to... Oh, uh, I want to get it to be lying that way, but right here. How can I do that? It'd be standing up here. It could be lying rolled here. Wait, standing up, lying rolled, standing up. No, no, no. I want, to, I want it to be like this, but right here. So standing up, rolled, standing up. The only way to get it standing up right here is if it's... Let's see. No, because I'd need to roll it in order to do this. Yeah. And this sure wouldn't help, would it? Yeah, because we can't even push it that way. <laughs> this just makes a raft. Hmm. We do this. Again, that's kind of pointless. Well, I could push something that way if it's rolling. Like that. Yay! Now I can push it up. Yay! <laughs> well, I'm not getting it. Maybe I can get down there. Well, no, maybe I can do something like this. So here we are, I can make a raft here, and then if I have something to push off with, like, <laughs> what happens if we try try this? Try to push it off into a log. Nothing. We just walk up. Okay. Um. Uh, we can do that. And then we can do this. Yay! Okay, if we can get the top one to be standing up right here, and then push it onto this stump, and then push it over, and then down. Hmm. There we go, it's standing up, but not quite in the right spot. Also, I don't see how we can get it down any farther. Okay, here's another spot we might be able to get across. Also, I couldn't figure out how to resolve this one, so... <laughs> silly me. Okay, now what do we want to do? We would want to roll a log across here. That would be a challenge. Because... Well, we can get it over to here. We need to 
solve this puzzle while still being able to roll this one. Challenge! Now we can just roll this one into the water and push that one up. But I don't want to roll it into the water, I want to finish it. Maybe not. Just leave it for now. Oh, hey, look, trees I just didn't use. Let's see. So, if we push this one up, we can push this one down. And then what? Push it into the water right there. Okay, well, we can push this one. Wait a minute. If we push this one this way, then, oh, no, that's right. I was like, well, we can push this one against it and then push it up, but there's a rock here. Hmm. We come in from the other side. Huh, that would require going around. Um, if we came in from the other side, what could we do? We could push this one down here. <laughs> Not a big help. And this is just mediocre. Looks like we need to come in from below in order to do that. So, let's see what's below. We can't even get below. That would be coming from over here. Which we tried to do. Didn't work out too well. Okay, time to check up here again to see if there's just something I missed. Like, this tree can't do anything. Can't get across the rocks. This tree won't go anywhere. Don't suppose there's anything else to do with this raft? Oh, am I? Oh! Oh, I guess I'm just going to a new place. <laughs> that was it! I guess I must have pushed off and gotten over to that spot. Huh. Yeah, from right there, remember? From right here? We pushed off to get over here. Alright, well... Uh, we're moving forward! I guess. Finally! Only one thing to do here. And then two things. I can either roll it or I can hop on it and hop off. I'm gonna roll it. See if maybe we want it over there. What do we want to do now? We want to just push something into the water. Um, we can go down pretty easily. I'm gonna push this one this way just in case. There we go. We could also try to get up. Okay, I cannot jump off of a log onto another log. What happens if I... Oh yeah, it just pushes it. Hmm. Can I... Can't push it into... Can't roll it into a stump. Thinking maybe I can make a raft over here, but I don't really want to make a raft over there. Oh well, we'll just come back. Looks like here we might need to do a raft. We can push this one up or down. My guess is down. And then what do we want here? We can push this one... Uh, up or down. If we push it up, then all we can do is get it into the water or set it up again. So down it is. I am starting to get the hang of these puzzles because it's like, oh, it, um, I could do this. I could roll it here, but it's too far. So if I had something else to stop it, and it's like, okay, where can I, how can I put this other log to put there to stop it? That's kind of the puzzle. Okay, we, we can, hmm, we can put this here. So maybe we need a raft right here. But yeah, so much of this puzzle, so much of this game has just been uh, get the things where you can get them. Okay. 
Where can I push this? I can push it left, which is useless. I can push it up, which will roll into either of the waters. I can push it to the right, which will roll it to be right here. That's exactly where I want it to go. Yeah! Haha! -ha. What is this? Rainbow pizza? Rainbow brittle. Humans use prisms to separate white light into rainbows for many years. Physically capturing rainbows came later, when optical scientists discovered in-prisming technology. Solid rainbows have minty flavor and were often sold as sweets. <laughs> Skittles. Alright, what do I want to do now? This one can go into that gap if I have to, oops, have to walk around to it. If I push it down, then it'll go in here sideways or go in here, that's pointless. Push it up, then I can roll it left and do nothing, or roll it right and fall into the water. That seems like the right choice. Roll it right from here, and then do this. Yeah! No! This is the clue, the only first choice. And what do I want to do here? Maybe I want to push this one in... No, I did push it in first. So, maybe there could be a way to... So this has to be the first move. I can't get anything else to go into place. I can push it this way and walk across here. If I wanted to what? No, I need this one. Right, because I can't get across with just this one. So that's the first move. It's the only possible first move. And I think what I want to do with this is use it for this one somehow. Let's see, a raft would do nothing. A, uh... Unless I could, like, push another one up here... Make a double raft. I don't know why I'd want to do that. If I push it up, I can push it left or right. And once it's in the water, it can't be moved unless it turns into a raft, I think. I could... What could I do? What could I do? So if I could get this single into the far side, then that would make a raft over there. But I don't think I can do that. What happens... I can't see it. What would happen if I tried to push the tree over this way? Onto this, like, but stand on the opposite side of the tree and push upward. Would it not fall, or would, would it, like, tumble over this one and land here? That seems like that would be the answer, because then I could just walk around here and push it over. Boy... Doesn't seem to be working. So what if I start by pushing this one down and then like one over here. Oh, then I can't get to the other one. Uh, wait a minute. What happens if I knock it into a rock over there? Ah, there we go. Okay, here we have just one tree. And this one tree can only get us to up here. So it looks like what we want to do is to push it over this raft and up into there. So, the only way to move it is to roll it. Because that's, that's one mechanic I figured out, is that when you have a tree, you can push it over, but then you can either only push it up or you can roll it. So the next move has to be a roll. So, there we go. Starting to figure out the rules to this game this far in. <laughs> so here's an easy thing. I'm gonna I assume I can just use this. I don't have to go into every single one. But you know. Yeah. This definitely looks like you want to come from above and push it to the right. So that's what I'm gonna try to do. A TV remote. Television wand. These ornate sticks were used to summon or banish entertainment from an electric box. Possession of this stick allowed the human user to choose what the entire group must watch, so the stick was the focus of much conflict. 
I love the way they just see it as like, oh yeah, this is a magical thing that humans did. And then it's just telling the truth. <laughs> Where am I trying to get to? Up maybe, like if I make a raft here or here, then push this log in the way I can push off the log. We haven't done that in a long time. Um, let's see. No, the only way that I can get over here is to lose a piece of wood. Unless I don't push it, then I can hop off, but then I can't retrieve this piece of wood. So, looks like I might have to either get rid of this one. No, not necessarily. I can push it upward. But like, how could I get something into water over here? I don't know if I could. Maybe I can get every single one to go down farther? Oh yeah, here we go. Whee! I put that there, and then... Do the same for this one. Whee! This looks like it's gonna be the gimmick of this world. Is making rafts on far logs. Okay, I could... No, probably not make a shortcut over there. What do I want to do here? Make a raft here. That's what I want to do. So, how am I going to do that? Let's start by pushing this one in place. Oh, here we go. We'll push this one here. Okay, so what I'm seeing is another rule is that if you roll a log into another log, if the other log is in the, is parallel to it or standing up, if the other log is parallel to it, it rolls away instead. If the other log is upright, it falls over. If the other log is perpendicular to it, then it just hits the end and doesn't move it. Okay, so here we go. Whee! I just want to take a quick look back over here. I definitely think we can get to some of these other islands right now, but I'll save that for later. I'll keep it going. Popcorn stand. There are two popcorn things where that, it looks like there's one. No munch. Yum yum. Let's throw it away. See, I'm gonna grab it and there's gonna be another one in this exact same place. Yeah! This is my favorite pastime. Throwing away popcorn. Okay, what can I do with this? I can go to the right or I can go up. I have a choice. Hmm. Well, let's, let's reset and see. Oh, no, I can't go up. Ha. Ooh. That's interesting. So then I wonder if maybe I'll be able to bring a log back over here and put it here. And then, like, I'll somehow get this one to reset without resetting myself over to here. Hmm. I don't know. Well, here's something that's pretty simple knock it over here. Alright, there's an extra tree here. Which maybe I can use to get up here? I don't know. They're gonna, gonna, this might be the gimmick is like, we have extra trees, use them wisely. Because I can definitely get up here now. Not. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. What if I roll it down instead? Well, I have to push one of these either up or this one to the right. Those are my only options. If I push this one up, then I can push this one this way. Then I can roll this one over there. No. Um, it would be neat if I could roll it across here so that it goes in the water right there. But I don't seem to be able to do that. So I'm going to start by pushing this one up and then this one down. And now I'm going to push it this way, because there's a rock there, and it kind of makes sense to have that be there. And... Now I can just push into the water here, but not where I want it to be. Hmm. Oh, I can push into the water here. Because then we can do this. Whee! Inflatable chick! 
This charming creature must be the juvenile form of the inflatable flamingo. After hatching from the inflatable egg, it takes to the water, bobbing about until it reaches maturity. If squeezed, it lets out a squeaky cry, presumably alerting parent birds to the danger. What now? Do we want to save this one? I assume we do, so I'm going to try doing the thing that will let us save it. Roll it over to there. Might regret that. Haven't thought ahead. Okay, that does allow me to save this one, though. We can push it down like this. Or what I probably want to do is to knock it one more down and push it down like this. No? Perhaps not. Hmm... Well, can't do it again. If I push it there, then the, 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 the thing there. And what if I do this? Now I can roll this across here. Oh, there we go. Interesting. That was cool. So this one looks like there's only one thing we can do with it. Well, maybe we could push it this way. Maybe we do want to push it that way. Hm. So... Yeah, I could do this. Maybe I don't want to, though. It's losing leaves. What do I want to do here? Do I want to make a raft? No, I want to push this one down and just get it to fall down. Hmm. Well, I can roll this one down. Don't know if that was any useful at all. Let's first try pushing this one here. Now we roll it down. And then we do the same for this one. Yeah. Cool. Now we have two options. We can either push off or we can look down here. I want to look down here first. Looks like it's a dead end. Hooray. House of Cards. Less a house and more of a gazebo, this type of human architecture required considerable dexterity to assemble. Humans would have found life far easier if they had just thought of gluing the cards together. <laughs> but no, it's part of, you, you know, you pieced a piece of it together in an earlier exhibit. This is a part of the art of one-upping each other. Which is a favorite human pastime. Okay, so I can't go- oops. It's a little bit annoying. I have to just go one square, not two. I guess I could have backtracked. Okay, now I can go over to here, or I can go over to here. So, what do I want to do? It looks like I might want to make a raft right here, but maybe not. <gasps> oh, this is this island! Ha! It's this one. So, oh, I see. Now we're maybe going to get up to the windmill. If we can figure out how. Ooh. Mmm. So what was the idea here? It was to push this one up like this. So now maybe we're going to figure out how to push this one down. Ha, 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 ha. I see! Look at this. Now we can push it in here and step on it without having a raft to push ourselves. Ha 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 ha! Finally we get over to here. Air mixer. Human air was composed of different gases like nitrogen, oxygen, argon, and carbon dioxide, and fungal spores. Obviously, humans didn't want too much of any one gas in the same place, so they invented big air mixers to disperse them evenly. Yeah, that's how science works. Okay, so there's two ways we can go, if we can figure out how. One of them is over here. Maybe if we... Okay, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, we can make a raft right here. Like this. There we go. And we can also go up. So we'll go this way first because up looked easier. And now what we want to do is make another raft it looks like. 
or... What? <laughs> so I have to knock the leaves off and then I can do something like this? <laughs> Interesting. Wait, what happens if I try to push this one while that one's there? Nothing. Okay. Just gotta know. Wee. <laughs> Wait, there's not like not anything over here, is there? No. What's this? A stuffed boar! A stuffed toy boar. Monster experts suggest that this part of human condition was the urge to turn any object into a stuffed toy. This plush wild pig is a mild manifestation of the affliction. We've also unearthed plush toilets, plush instruction manuals, and plush fish fingers. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and plush things from every Let's Player and Twitch streamer in existence. Except me, because... I'm, for one, I'm too small to get into that kind of thing, and for two, I don't really want to. <laughs> okay, how do I roll something? How do I roll one of these and get it into the right place? If I push it up, then what does that do? Not much. I could, here's how I roll. Just like that. And I can do the same thing with this one. But I want to wait until I've done this. There we go. And here we go. Yeah! And we probably want to do the same thing with these. Um, well this one is going to be difficult to get off the top. So, okay. So it looks like what I want to do is I just want to use it as a, a stopper. Yeah! One option. Blueberries! Plums! From Human Icebox. We have exhibited the plums that were in some kind of human icebox, which were labeled Philippia's Breakfast. Apologies to Philippia, but they look delicious and fill the gap in our collection. <laughs> what is this log here for? We must be able to do something with it. Oh! This is what we can do with it. Aha! Hmm. Now what? We can go up, it looks like. How can we go up? Huh. Strange. Um. Okay. If we can get one of them to be longwise here and then roll the other one over it, then we can get it up to be there. That seems to be the only way I can think of. Um, and we can get it longwise like this. Now the question is, how can we get this one up there? <laughs> Looks like we want to use this tree somehow to prevent this one from rolling into the water. So, if maybe we can... Now if we push it this way, then pushing... Oh, no, that would work. If we want to push it this way, I was like, but then that would make this push it in the water. But we want it to be in the water, right there. Here we go. Yeah. And now what? Looks like we want a raft. Okay, what do we want to do? We want to... We can't push this one. We can push it up. I think I want to get it into a place where we can push this one up. No, not up. Down. And roll into it? Hmm. Well, we have to get both of them over to here. So... Well, this one's gonna be easy. What about this one? Also easy? No, not also easy. Because that's gonna roll the wrong way. So, can we, like, roll it somewhere else? That's what we need the first one for. So that we can roll this one into it. So, like, 
this? Will this do it? That might do it. I think that'll do it. Because we can roll it down, and then we can just push it in. Yeah! And that, there's a whole bunch of other ways we could have gone in that area, so that's something to look forward to when we come back. Hey look, it's our friend! A palm tree! It's just too high. And again, two directions to go. Let's hop over to here first. And you know what? Let's explore over here a little bit more, because we had multiple ways to go and we didn't. First, up here! Alright, we got ourselves two trees. We need these two trees to block each other. Like this. Uh, I'm guessing. Easy, easy. Now we probably just want to put something up here because it's probably just an alt path to get there. What's that down there? Let's see if I can look at it by no okay how would I there's only two ways okay there's three ways I can push this what about this one I can push it this way I don't want to though I want this one to be in the way how can we get this one in the way hmm maybe I want to start it by pushing this one this way because then we can push it down there we go. And right here is where we want it to be. Yeah! Alright, now there's this way. Okay, we have two trees. And it looks like we probably want to use this one to get this one in a good place. So let us begin by doing this. And we push it up. Well, that doesn't quite do what I wanted to do, but it's okay, because we can just put it right here and get ourselves across. Didn't quite do what I was thinking, but it did good anyway. So there's another island down there. We can clearly see something through the mist. Anyway, we're not getting there at the moment. Looks like maybe we could if we could get a, ooh, a raft right here. But I don't see a way to do that because of the positioning of this tree. Even if we could roll one of those over to here. Or two? Like both of these? <laughs> Hello, snowman friend. Like... Oh. Never mind. <laughs> what do we do with these? Oh, we make a raft right here. I see. So, what I want to do is to... See what prevents me from just pushing this one in place. Nothing. Oh, it's this one that has difficulty getting pushed in place. But we can just... Yeah. There we go. Bye-bye, friend. And now we're back over here by a different path. Cool. What else is there in the middle? What other way might we get into the middle? By raft? Maybe by that one up there? That would require us having to build a raft right here, which looks difficult. Oh, hey, the, f the fog kind of goes away. Oh, look at this. It looks like that might be a way back. Like, no? Hmm. No, it looks like these are just kind of random. There is another thing right here, which suggests uh, either we push through somewhere or we push down from right there. Yeah, I'll come back to it later. Okay, two things to do. This is the one that could be useful in the future. So it looks like I might want to get this palm tree to be right here. Anyway... Let's see, we cannot simply do that right now, so let's try pushing this down and pushing this this way. Here we go. This gets this one in place. And it also gets this one in place. Cool! 
All right, we just want to go over here. And... Yeah, raft wouldn't work. Oops. <laughs> so one possibility would be to... What? So we either want to get one of the trees right here, or two trees in a row right here. That part looks freaking impossible, so we'll think of trying to get one tree right here. Now it's going to be complicated. Because... We're going to have to need to use one tree to get the other one to go in. Okay, so what we have to do, we would have to have it standing up here, which means we have to have it longwise here. Which means it either rolls up and runs into something right here. Could be. Okay, so what, let's... Okay, I think I solved it backwards. Here we go, we put this one right here, and now we roll this one upward into it. Yeah. And put it here. Okay, what do we want to do now? It looks like we can get over to the right by having a three long right here. If we can figure out how to do that. Maybe not. Hmm, maybe coming from the other side and pushing this one down. No, that wouldn't help. Hmm. Uh, or we could have a too long right here, or a too long right here. That might be a better idea. So, if we push this one to the left, then we push it up, but it has to hit something else like this. There we go. There we don't go. That just hops into the water like that. Hmm. Oh, here we go. We push it up against the stump. Cool! We found our way. So this path is going to go up that way. And this path is going to go over this way. So, what can we do here? We can... make ourselves a raft. No need for a raft, though. Well, yeah, we probably do, actually. But not like that. So what would we need to do? It looks like we either need one vertical to be here, or vertical to be here. Let's try getting it vertical. So if we're going to do that, then we need to push this one down so that it has something to knock into. Now do we want to push it left? Yeah, it looks like it. Because then we can push it up twice, and then right, and it's in place. Hehe. <laughs> a shark! Message in a bottle in a shark. <laughs> this shark contains a clear bottle, which in turn contains a rolled-up sheet of paper. Scanning the document with an in-shark photography reveals the message. Anthony, I bet you a million billion pounds that no shark will ever eat this. Congratulations, Anthony. <laughs> All right. We got to ourselves another mailbox. It looks like it comes around from that side, so I'm going to go around and come at it from that side. Here we are on the unsolved island. Let's see, what do we need? It looks like we need this one. Not that way. But we need it to go up here. So let's push it vertical in a place where we can retrieve it. So like this. And now we're going to need to push it upward, or push it to the right. Um, maybe it's not so easy. Or, what's another possibility? If we could get, we could get it to be here and then have a raft. We could get it to be somewhere and have a raft. No, I'm not sure. So if we push it, that just pushes it in the water. Um, oh yeah, here we go. Push this one this way, and then... Now we can... Yeah. Oh, no. Mm. <laughs> we can push this one here, and then... Like this. Great.
Okay, what if we try pushing this now? There we go, there we go. Now we can just push this one up to here. And we have this extra log if we can figure out a way to use it. Business snorkel. Human transit during pre-work and post-work periods sometimes got so crowded that small business folks struggle for oxygen amidst ties and armpits. A business snorkel allowed users to suck in air from above the crowd and thus survive the commute. Ooh, sounds rough. Okay, so there's an island up there that we could get to maybe somehow. But here we go, we've completed the circle. There is this extra log over here. And there seems to be maybe an island over here. So let's see if there's anything we can do with this log. We can make it into a raft. I don't really want to make it into a raft. What I want to do is be able to roll it straight up here. Never mind. That would get us nowhere. So, uh, roll it there, I guess. Okay. No, I want to leave it so it's easy to access next time. So I noticed that you always come out on this side of the mailbox, but you can go in from any side. That could lead to teleportation sometime, perhaps. Uh, maybe inconvenient if you want to go back, but still, could be a mechanic. Let's see, what do I want to do here? Maybe I want to put one right here. That would make sense. Uh, because we can make a raft. Let's see, if I do this, I can push it back. That's just fine. And what do we want to do with this one? We could push it here. And yep. That would allow us to do something. To push it here. Why would we want it to be here? Hmm, another thought I have is that we have three trees, so if we could get a raft, we could use a tree as something to push off of. We haven't done that in a while. Hmm. Well, one way to easily get this into place. No, never mind. That's not going to work. <laughs> we could push it up and push it this way and push it down. There we go. And now we can get it into place. Why didn't that work for this one? Oh yeah, because it's too close. Okay. So what we want to do is we want to just push it straight back up and then we want to push this one this way from here. Yeah, now we can get it into place there. And for here, this is the one we want to leave it down for. Because it has this ocean spot, which we couldn't walk into if it were up. All right. Now what? How can we do anything with this? Oh, I see. Heh. And now we can do this. Okay, and we could probably do something similar with this one. Probably what it's going to ask us to do. Overdue library book. At first, experts tried to reunite this book with its human library. Then we calculated the late fee, and quite honestly, we do not have that much human money in the museum. We have decided to keep the book and risk the wrath of a creature called a librarian. <laughs> well, if you've played Tunic, you know that librarians can be quite scary. Okay, we've got to put this in place. We have to push it right here. And now we gotta do a similar thing, or we have to actually get up here now. Nope, doesn't look like we can, because the only place to put this too tall tree would be right here, and there's a rock at the other side. And, uh, yeah, there's, there's, a uh, these two are both one space of water. So, what we gotta do now is we gotta put this one in the right place. And I don't, yep, there it is, right place. Hey, hey. And now this one is going to require two. We got to first push it down right here. We. And then we got to get it in place so we can push it up. 
Trojan Woodlouse scale model. <laughs> the success of the Trojan horse as both a gift and an unexpected entry method led the global trend for hollow wooden creatures. This is a Trojan Woodlouse, actually made in Birmingham. It holds up to six small humans, making it ideal for children's surprise parties. Ha 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 I love this game. There we go. These puzzles were not too bad. Are we doing the same thing again? Looks like it. Know where to push this tree to. Alright, so we'll push it right down here. And then this one, we gotta get up here. Microscope! Humans use the microscope as a way of spying on bacteria and other tiny people. Unbeknownst to humans, bacteria were well aware of the massive eyes staring down at them and would play tricks on the scientists, altering their behavior for the duration of the surveillance. <laughs> okay, what would we want to do here? If we push it to the right, we can only push it down, which gets in the water or up, which gets it here, which would make it stuck. We could push it down, which is useless. We could push it up, which puts it right here. The only way to could roll it over here. Useless. We could go back. Oh, here we go. We go back, and then we did not push this rock, um, log. And now this one's just in place, in a different place. Now we can push it up here. Ha! Huh. This is a creative, clever puzzle. And now we're just here, and this one is in place from the last time we pushed it. Ha! Huh. And then that's the end of that. And here we have some more coffee. And I think this is a good place to end this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Let me know what you thought in the comments and subscribe for more Monsters Expedition and other awesome games. I'll see you next time. Bye.